Hey, what's up, guys? Um, this is a new channel, Socrats, and right now we're playing uh, Legend of Zelda: Breath of the Wild. And right now we are Sheikah getting Slate. the Sheikah Take Slate. It. it will help guide you after you And slumber. Zelda's mumbling on about things. All right. So we're gonna be taking the Sheikah Slate. And trying to do, um, let's see, probably about half the, half the Great Plateau today. So, we're gonna talk to the old man, uh, get a tower, maybe one, maybe two shrines. Alright, so let's get the, I believe, trousers. Yep. Then the shirt, it should be right here. All right, and let's go examine the Sheikah Slate. Hold the Sheikah Slate up to the pedestal. That will show you the way. All right, so uh, the door should open and then there should be one of the million cutscenes on the Great Plateau. This is probably my favorite cutscene. I don't really like any of the other ones. They're just kind of boring. All right. Link, thinking it's bright. Link, you are the light. Our light. That must shine upon High Rule once again. All right. Now go. Okay, so let's put on our clothes first. So it's not in his navy underwear. Not right now, stamina. All right. Um, let's climb this rock. Into the cutscene we go. Oh, there's an eagle. Um, comment down below if there's always an eagle or, because I don't remember there being an eagle, or is it just depending on when you come out of the Shrine of Resurrection? So yeah, I would like to know if any of you guys know. There's the old man, and the temple, I'm gonna go talk to him. Alright, I'm getting our first weapon, our stick, the most powerful weapon we'll ever get. Alright, let's get the Italian shrooms. These are pretty good, uh, they're about, I think, half a heart. And for like, um, the Great Plateau, those are pretty good, since you only have three hearts to start off with. So, actually, I mean... I've played this game before, it was a while ago, though, but I'm just gonna skip the old man because I already know what he wants and everything, so, so here, let's get the axe, um, oh, what are these things called? Korok, yeah, Korok, alright, I'm pretty sure there's... 900 of them and we have one so yeah okay the rusted broadsword all right uh oh, link ran out of stamina again for such a like powerful um he's like such a powerful uh character compared to like all this other, um, all these other games Nintendo makes. He sure doesn't have a lot of stamina, even if you get it to, like, full stamina. Like, I mean, you can, like, climb quite high with the full stamina ring. But, uh, here's hey, another cutscene. I think, uh, Head for the point this is where she gives us, she the, um, Great Plateau Tower location. 
Alright, so let's go there first and then actually let's get the like the howling trousers or something. Alright, let's not waste our weapon durability fighting him. Alright, let's get him. Oh. Oh, come on, you're, just, you're being in the middle. get out of there. I think these are the Halloween trousers, yeah. All right, so now we're gonna go uh, get the tower, which is right here. Oh, let's get this um, stake, I think, yeah, stake. All right, then, uh, oh, I think these guys have, like, arrows. Yeah, these guys are the one. They both have arrows and bow, which I need to, um, that's one of the big weapons. Alright. Don't have a shield. Alright, let's eat. Uh, never mind. Or one third of a heart. I think they have a heart. Never mind. Uh, we're loading his bow. Okay, got a bow cobo. Okay, release fire. Two arrows. And whatever he has, a bow coblin horn. All right. Let's snipe this guy in the head. There's another here. Okay. Oh, there we go. We're gonna get a uh, Boko shield and a traveler sword. Okay. Let's switch to that. Okay. And get our first tower of the game. So this tower, um, basically, I activates all the shrines in the game so like you can't really start your like shrine hunting um you can't really start shrine hunting till you activate this so you have to do this first and then it brings up all the other towers in the game so um yeah, there's a squirrel. Any birds yet? Um, cobbling. Dramatic cutscene. Then I think after this, the old man comes flying down in his paraglider asking us if we want it and basically teasing us that we can't get it until we finish all the shrines, which is, I think, four or five. Yeah, I think it's four. All right, so now we have... Um... Whatever this, st this stuff is even supposed to be, dropping onto our Sheikah slate. And now, what happens? Oh, yeah, that's what. I forgot what the towers were even for. You get the map um, for like that section of the area where the, sh uh, not shrine, uh, tower is. Right, I'm gonna just skip this. And I'm gonna just climb down. Alright, I have died on this trying to do this. Like back in when it was like 2017 when this game first came out. Oh darn. Yeah, that happened, but I was really high up. Um yeah, but I did that. I just jumped off not knowing what was going to happen, and I died, and my last, like, my last saving 
autosave was, I think, um, hmm. like right by where the old man is. It's like right outside hmm. the Shrine of Resurrection. Okay, basically he's just explaining mm -hmm. to us um, Clement Ganon, how he took over the castle, and that um, that after we get off the Great Plateau, we need to go to the castle. But um, I don't think we're gonna do that. We'll uh, we're gonna mm. go get um. <laughs> Probably start off with getting one of the divine, divine beasts. I'm not sure which one, um, but we won't go straight to the tower. Hmm. Uh, I'll probably only go to the tower once or twice, and when I'm sorry, not the tower, the castle. But and when I do, one of those times we'll probably we'll probably try to beat Calamity Ganon. But that will be in a while. It won't be like the start. All right. So first, this is uh, the Magnesis Shrine, I think. Yeah, the Magnesis Shrine. So we're gonna get that. Oh, darn it! I keep forgetting that I have so little stamina. So. Get it here. Okay. Going into it. And we are here. Magnesis trial. Um I think this is like the first time we fight one of those like mini guardians that like shoot the little lasers. Um, like, I think they're called, uh, Shrine Guardians, because I think you can only find them in side shrines. You can only fight the, like, regular big ones. And then there's some that have, um, like, weapons for test of strength, but it's a different kind of shrine. Can open this up. I'm not sure if we're gonna need that later. Um, well, let's get back up. All right, let's. Here, actually, let's eat real quick. Don't want to die. Uh, what do we have? Okay. Um, there's a box there. I can push this. Okay, okay. Pull it out. There we go. Oh, 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 okay. Do that. Oh, yep, yeah, here it is. Right, I'm gonna try to parry it. <laughs> That's not gonna work. So, let's just kill it. I haven't parried in a very long time. Okay. Um. Get this bridge. Bring it right. Oh, yeah, is that good? Oh, that's barely hanging on. Okay. Why is it? Do you have to push in or out? I always get confused. Actually, is that metal? Oh, nice. You can snag the chest real quick. Don't follow me. Oh, nice, a traveler's bow. Those are um, pretty good for starting off um, the game. Let's go activate that. They're kind of cool looking too. It looks like like, um, like a Robin Hood almost. All right. These are like the Sheikah monks. Let's get a skip. First spirit orb. Ho! 
Oh, is that the old manic? I don't remember this cutscene. Seems you've managed to get your hands on a spirit or well done. How did you know? Huh. <laughs> Alright. Oh, they just hmm. telling me to go to like different shrines because there's like the four shrines. Is he telling me about them? This is the end of my first video. Hope you come back and watch some more.